हरिओम स्वामी जी वॉट एवर वी डू विल ब्रिंग हैप्पीनेस टू सम एंड पेन टू अदर्स हाउ टू ब्रिंग जॉय टू ऑल नॉट नेसेसरली बट आई डू अग्री दट देर वुड बी सम एक्शंस विच माइट गिव जॉय टू अदर्स and may not be the same to others where does it happen if we try to analyze we will find that when we operate it from our core being the higher level not from the individual level it will become joy to everyone at the individual level actions may bring joy to some and suffering to others so by raising ourselves to the impersonal level impersonal level means you know for enabling us to understand we can say the level of values we can ensure harmony for instance a mother's discipline may seem painful But her child knows she acts out of love. This love transcends temporary suffering, leaving no negative impression. Another example that comes up our mind is when we cultivate rice, you know, paddy, you know. After sowing, you know, after some time, we have to remove the weeds, removing the weeds is a process of suffering, no doubt. But there, the selfish interest is not there because the, the, when you we produce more, it helps the society too. Similarly, when we deal with men and matters, they may inadvert inadvertently harm others, but from the impersonal level, no harm is done because there is no selfishness there. That means such acts become unselfish. when we shift from personal to the impersonal impersonal means you know values emerge from our core of our being basically intrinsically essentially we are values embodied but the sense of individuality overpowers it and then all our problem comes so our core nature value when it is guiding us to act without harming others no one will feel get burdened or hurt by elevating our actions to this level to this higher level we ensure that our dealings are guided by universal values bringing joy and harmony to all this may look to be a tall talk but it is not so every time when we before we talk before we think before we act whether it will harm anybody if i have to if i check up then i will mellow down even if i may not be able to avoid certain actions but the the way of presentation also will change is she telling you are you are wrong you no know? you can say i don't think that is right you no know? or i am not very clear about your stand so there is a there is a method of approach by which this uh, harming or what you call hurting can be reduced or erased even our body language and our vocal language you know <laughs> both if it uh, if it is always reverted to this principle that i none of my thoughts words and deeds should be harmful to others sarva bhuta hiterata you know suppose we keep on trying to live up to it we may be able to pass the test to a very great extent hari om